The brand new Formula E Gen 2 car boasts a brilliantly futuristic design. Some are even calling it the Batmobile. And it's given the Mahindra team a brand new challenge as it seeks to make the new M5 Electro package as competitive as possible. Aiming to hang on to the properties from the old car, which enabled close on-track action with minimal aerodynamic disturbance, Formula E has updated the aesthetics of the package to bring the championship into a brand new era, while also boosting the efficiency of the underbody and reducing reliance on wings for downforce. At the front, it's all changed. A raised nose has been discarded and replaced by a new low-slung nose, paired with covered front wheels to reduce the overall drag. Behind the front wheel, the bodywork is shaped to manage airflow, pushing it outwards to limit its effect on the rest of the car. Both the body and the side pods are quite dramatically sculpted to help manage the airflow. And also, I think it really complements the modern aesthetics of the car. With this sort of notable undercut just ahead of the side pods, it really helps effectively manage the airflow and also improves the underbody aero output. Featuring an innovative solution to the aero package at the rear end, the Gen 2 car does away with the conventional rear wing setup. Instead, opting for two small wing designs above the rear wheels, cutting the effect of turbulence behind the car and helping it to create even closer racing. In place of the rear wing, a large diffuser has been included to improve underbody aerodynamics. This gives the driver more rear end downforce, more control and allows close wheel to wheel combat as Mahindra's cars do battle with the rest of the field. Join us for the very final episode of Mahindra Blueprints, where we'll be taking a look at the latest safety equipment on board the M5 Electro, including that brand new Halo device.